Hey everybody, um, this is Dr. Smith uh, from Accomplished Health and Wellness, and I am doing a extra tea time today. And um, this is my trusty assistant, Elsie. And we did have tea. Um, I I drank it. <laughs> yeah. She drank hers, and I drank mine. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I um. So in my tea this morning was immune, bu Im immune boost, if I can say it. And in her tea this morning was, what was your throat coat? Throat coat. And then I put honey in it and a drop of lemon essential oil and a drop of thieves essential oil. And I already drank it and she drank hers. And the reason that, and she had the same mixture. So the reason that we had that is because someone, hey, hey. I won't name any names, brought a lovely cold into our household. It wasn't me. And no. someone decided to give the said cold to other members of the family. And Not said, my fault. Everyone drinks out of my drink. I got it too. So, plus someone forgets how to cover her cough. So, anyways, now as you can imagine, we have stuff all in here, okay, right? No. And um, so she has. Don't do that. She okay. has um sinus congestion, right? And so, you know how when you get those colds and then you're like, I can only grow on one side and your whole face feels like it's like 20 sides bigger on one side <laughs> versus the other and it's awful, it's not and all that. So today I'm going to do another episode of osteopathic techniques you can do at home. And this one is for um, drainage of the sinuses. And so it's called trigeminal stimulation and it's gonna hit three um, areas of the trigeminal nerve, which is actually going to stimulate your um, sinuses to drain. And in kids, oftentimes this will work within five minutes, and it's really actually pretty cool. Um, when I do this on my son, who is two, um, I can actually hear him get better. I need to film that someday um, because you can actually hear him start to breathe better. Um, in older adults, um, it, it will again start to clear up in about five to ten minutes. And it usually lasts somewhere between 30 minutes and an hour, and then you start to get congested again. But you can do this like multiple times a day. Um, it's really super easy. So let's get on with it. And just so you know, she also has some congestion in her ear. I already did the auricular drainage of gallbladder technique. So here we're gonna go. Usually when you do this technique, they're laying on their back, but in order for you guys to see, um, she's going to lay on her side. So when you do this, um, and you're gonna do both sides, so usually I'll do both sides at the same time, but um, I'm just gonna show you one side at a time, or one side, and then you can you know, extrapolate it to the other side. So anyways, what you're gonna do is feel in your eyebrow and you'll feel a little divot. Um, sometimes it's kind of um, like a bigger divot, um, just depending on how your um, nerve comes out here. So this is gonna, what you're looking for is the supra um, orbital foramen and that's where the nerve comes out. And so you're gonna basically find that little divot, which is usually right around the middle of your eyebrow and then you're gonna rub it. Rub it, rub it, rub it. And then you go straight down and you just rub it for like 20 seconds. Um, and then you go straight down onto the cheekbone. And there is um, pretty much in a line, there's gonna be another divot there. Sometimes this one's yeah. a little bit harder to feel just because um, oftentimes this will be where a lot of the congestion is. And, um, and this one will be uncomfortable. Um, and so you find it and then you rub it. Rub it, rub it, rub it. And you actually rub it until it really doesn't hurt anymore, but that's usually like 20 seconds or so. 
Well, and then um, you will go straight down and you'll see actually she's getting a little bit red here and that's um, a sign that she has some congestion there. So this one's called the infraorbital foramen that you're looking for. And then down here is the submental foramen. And um, it actually, um, this one, I don't feel like it feels like a divot like the other ones. Um, I feel almost like this one feels like a little um, thing of spaghetti coming out. <laughs> and that's what it feels like under my hair. So you find your little piece of spaghetti coming out on your face. And then um, this one, again, you just rub just like that for 20 seconds. And then you would, um, so then after that, oh. you come back up. She doesn't like this one. And rub it. Stop it. And then you go back up to the top again and rub it. And then you go back down. Ow! It hurts. So dramatic. And I rub. And then you go back up. So usually, um, so um, usually I would do them together. So I'll do this side too so, while I'm talking. Uh -huh. And you just, um, when you're doing this one, you'll go um, down and then up. And then down. And then up. I'll have her turn on this. You can see, um, you can see actually, see where her cheek is all red there. Um, that's from the sinus congestion. Um, it just changes things when you're probably in the face. So usually I do them together. Um, I'll go start here and I go down, up, down, up. And that's all you have to do. It's super easy. Um, and it'll drain your sinuses for like, <coughs> bless you. <laughs> See, we're all sneezing and coughing and dripping and whatever. Um, so it'll um, drain your sinuses for about an hour and then they'll start to come back again. And so when they come back again, you just do it again. You could do it multiple times a day. It doesn't really matter. Um, and then if you want to add some immune boost, can't say that for some reason. Im immune. immune boost, um, you know, in your tea, you can um, add in some bees and some lemon, which help to um, boost your immune system a little bit. And um, so hopefully you got something from this today. If you didn't, I'm sorry. Um, but we will, we are going to continue with some of these. So I'll do them weekly as long as I have my trusty assistant here. I don't know so she goes back to school. And um, so next week we'll do a few other things that I do for um, patients that are just acutely ill. Please excuse her for blowing her nose in the background. So hopefully you enjoyed this and I hope you guys have a good rest of your day and don't get this summer cold that's going on. Please don't. It Bye. Sucks.